Hello everybody, this is Bronwyn from Tarot Fever. And today I've got a few decks I wanna go through while I have the chance, while my little boy is at school and I have some time to myself. So um, this is the Sacred Forest Oracle by Denise Lynn. It's a Hay House deck. Typical two-piece sturdy box. There's the back. This was published, I think, in May of 2021, so it's still fairly new. Here's the inside of the top. <clears throat> Enter a secret dimension to discover the truth of your soul. And this is the lower part of the box. So inside the box, you've got your cards and your guidebook. The guidebook is um, a decent, nice little guidebook. Uh, it's black and white, doesn't have any pictures in it. But you get two pages for each card. And there are a few spreads. One card, three card reading. So for the three card, it's blockage, healing, and outcome. Five card spread, messages from your spirit guides. Tree of life spread. Four directions spread. One year spread. So... Yeah, it's a nice little guidebook. Oh, the other thing is it comes with a code. This is a great bonus. On page four, I've got my thumb over the code. I don't want to accidentally give content that belongs to Hay House away. Um, but you just go online and enter this product ID and download download code and you get uh, like a 10 minute-ish, maybe it's seven minutes. They're a decent length. Meditation by Denise Lynn. Um, for every card in the deck, which is pretty nice, I have to say. I mean, this deck was, I think, $28, so it's a very good value, especially when you factor in the free meditations. Um, what was I going to point out? Oh, I wanted to look for the artist. Who did the art for this deck? Page 141, Scott Breedenthal. Oh, I haven't heard of him before. So Scott Breedenthal is the person who did the art on the Sacred Forest deck, and he did a great job. So these are the backs. It's like a winged Pegasus. I wasn't sure I'd like this deck because honestly, I'm not really into like some of the sort of pixie fairy sort of imagery that's in it. But once I had it in my hands, I fell in love with it. It's so vibrant and so colorful. And um, I did edge this deck in with a Tombow in like a sort of hunter green. So it did not come like this. There are 52 cards, so it's a, de a decent size. The card stock is the new Hay House stock, which I know some people don't like, but I actually really like it. It's, it bounces, it snaps back really well, it's matte, it shuffles like a dream. Um, it's got some nice ASMR qualities when you're sitting shuffling it. I just, I really like it. The other decks I have that are in the same or similar card stock are the Oracle of the Seven Energies by Colette Baron reed and the Shaman's Dream Oracle, also um, Colette Baron reed and Alberto Valaldo. And there is one other, oh, the, the Priestess of Light, who, which is by Sandra Ann Taylor, I think. Okay, so I'm gonna zoom in on the cards and we'll do a quick flip.
I love the cards with birds. So many of these cards just make my heart just, oh, so happy. The colors. See, stuff like this, when I saw online, I was like, ugh, not really my thing. Um, I mean, it's beautiful. It's just not really something that I would normally, or in the past, have been drawn to. But I, I bought the deck regardless because I had a feeling about it. And I was right. It works well for me. This is a beautiful card. So the cards are numbered, as you can see, um, and in alphabetical order, and you get the title and a keyword. Love the colors in this. Just that beautiful red maple, especially this time of the year. And that card is also the back. I love this dress. <laughs> I would love to have that dress. You really get a feel for all of the seasons. I do love this card with the snow globe. Just that feeling of being cozy and warm in the middle of a storm. And that's coming soon enough. I oh, love this, the standing stones passage. Beautiful. All right, so that is the Sacred Forest deck. I'm just gonna zoom back out here and shuffle them a bit, just so people have an idea. I love the way this cardstock shuffles. And then I'll give them a ripple. I've never shuffled on this table before. This is, I'm at my mom's house. And yeah, I'm a, a little too high up to get a good ripple shuffle, but there you go. That's, that gives you an idea. So that is the Sacred Forest Oracle by Denise Lynn. And thanks for watching and I hope you have a great day.